girls. If you're in the market for some cool shoes, I wanted to do a review for this. This is a 5.11's North Sneaker in Dark Coyote. Uh, if you haven't heard of 5.11, go and Google them, do some research. They're pretty cool. Uh, they're local to me, which makes it even cooler, and uh, they seem to be all about uh, being prepared, being ready, everyday carry, and uh, yeah, let's break it down for you. All right, so we've got the 511, again, Norris Sneaker Dark, uh, Dark, uh, Dark Coyote. So... This is the shoe. This is in a uh, 10. They seem to run a little big because I normally wear a 10 and a half, but uh, this 10 actually works perfectly for me. And uh, again, this is the dark coyote color. It comes in black, comes in blue, and uh, also comes in like an army ranger green color as well. And uh, let me get you a closer up look to it. We got some ventilation there for the side. Um, the soles are pretty thick. Definitely has some comfort for walking and jogging and things like that. Probably wouldn't wear these for running. Um, main thing is like usually when you, that, that area over there, you know, usually breaks loose with the glue. So far, no issues there. Seems to be pretty strong. And supposedly these, uh, these shoes, the sole is supposed to be like if you step on a nail or something sharp, it'll go through the padding, but it actually won't go through the sole of the shoe to actually, you know, hit you. I've seen some people on YouTube where they put a nail down and they'll just, you know, hammer it and definitely didn't seem like it seeped through, which is good. Um, pretty stylish, pretty, pretty good looking shoe. I didn't even know, honestly, they made shoes until I saw this on, uh, on the internet and I was like, they make shoes? Five eleven puncture resistant, of course, as it says. So, you know, time, I guess time will tell. So I've had these now for about um, three, four days. Done some walking, did a little bit of jogging, moving around, jumping up and down, things like that. I, I literally try to like just break these in. Um, I was looking for a shoe. I do a lot of walking for work and moving around. I wanted a shoe that was comfortable, um, somewhat stylish, and at the same time also had utility purpose to it. And what I mean by that, like I wanted something that was going to be durable, going to last me a while, uh, that I could use outside of work if I'm in the desert going shooting or kneeling, need to kneel, crouch, whatever. I just really wanted something almost like a work boot, but not a full on work boot. And I think this is the closest that you're going to get to that. Um, it has pretty high, um, comes up pretty high, so it does get close to your ankle. So it feels like you have some ankle support when you wear it. Um, I'm not gonna say it feels like a New Balance shoe or you know one of those type of doctor shoes, but it definitely is comfortable uh, for standing or walking long periods of time. And my previous shoe was a New Balance, and uh, I just switched over to this now because honestly, New Balance wasn't even comfortable after a while. Um, but this shoe is seems honestly seems to be worth the money. I paid uh, with the Labor Day sale; it was eighty-four dollars out the door. Um, I originally wanted black, but they didn't have that, so I got this Coyote Brown, um, which I don't regret by any means at all. And like I said, these have been comfortable. They have withstand with uh, the abuse that I've put it through. I've been on my Ninja Court and walked through there. I've been flexing it around, jumping in the desert a little bit. No issues with it. Um, plus, I mean, after the use, it doesn't even actually show that it's been really use it doesn't have any wear and tear on it so it seems like it's gonna have a pretty long life of the shoe as well which is nice but uh yeah if you're in the market for a new shoe you want something that's kind of like a combat boot or work boot but not a full-on boot um i'm gonna suggest that you look into this shoe here because this is uh this is pretty cool i also don't know of any other company or any other shoe that's similar to this um it is puncture resistant and I will link the uh, manufacturer website in the description below. And uh, I will link it directly to the shoe. And uh, I think they also have a commercial as well. And I will uh, link you that commercial. And uh, here, I'll, I'll loosen it up here and put it on just so you can kind of see.
puncture resistant, 511. Coyote Brown. If I had to describe this shoe in three words, I would say uh, comfort, stylish, utility. That's the three words I would use to describe this type of shoe. So, I mean, looking at it, not every day I put my foot on YouTube, but if you look at it here, uh, you figure your ankle's right there. It definitely gives you some support for your ankle. So it's nice because if I'm out in the desert and I'm stepping on, stepping on rocks or un, uh, unlevel terrain, this kind of protects my ankle essentially from slipping out and twisting to the side, which is nice. Um, but I mean, this is really honestly comfortable. Like these are comfortable. I mean, I've got these, these house shoes and I would say these are even more comfortable. I don't like wearing shoes in the house, but good God, I, these are nice. I do like wearing them all the time. And uh, I mean, like I said, I do a lot of standing, walking, moving around for work. Um, I probably walk maybe 9,000 steps a day and I have no problem with these shoes. These are, these are great. So again, if you're in the market or you're just curious, I'm gonna strongly suggest that you check out the company 511. They are, I think based out of uh, Arizona, they have a couple locations. Uh, they do have free shipping from what I saw, and they have free returns as well, so 5.11. North Sneaker, Dark Coyote. And they do seem to run a little bit bigger, so like uh, I said, I normally wear a 10.5. This is a 10, but this fits me perfectly fine. Uh, but again, they do have free returns, so if it doesn't fit you, you can go ahead and send it back for any reason. Uh, I'd say unboxing, but I mean, it's, it's a shoe. There's really not that much in it to really say anything about it. Um, but they are comfortable. Price is right. They work. All right, guys, you guys have a good one, and I will see you next time.